Hello everyone, welcome back. Welcome back to another episode of Battlefield 1 Story Mode. We've done the Free Man of Blood, we just completed that last one. Now we're going to go to the next stage, which is Friends in High Places. So let's get straight into Before it. Before I got to Europe, I had never seen an aeroplane in real life. High above, they twisted and turned like flocks of birds dancing. There was a romance surrounding pilots, these new swashbucklers of the skies. But the reality was, most of these brave young men would eventually end up back on the ground in twisted smoking wrecks. Damn. Right, test flight. Let's do this. Play chapter. Boom! France, spring 1977. Allies are losing the war in the air. Germany's Air Force down and dominates the Western Front, a range of superior aircraft on the Western. Blah blah blah. Claiming this work, it was Britain's Royal Flying Corps. Cops struggles to complete. Most replacement pilots have experience of less than 10 hours. That was last time on air. It was 17 days. It shit. New innovations are gamble, some are effective, some are not. Aviators risk their lives with unproven technologies. Those that beat the odds are either adapt quickly or are lucky. Or fucking die. Damn, war is brutal. War is super brutal. I have nothing left to bet, you idiot. The plane. <laughs> That's rich. <laughs> oh, why the hell not? I've got you beaten anyway. Uh, yeah. What have you got? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Wipe your mouth, Blackburn. That wasn't supposed to happen. <laughs> dum, dum. But you know, I'll be taking that plane anyway. What the bloody hell? You <laughs> lost. I beat you. Mm. The thing is, Rackham, it's a very beautiful aeroplane, and you're kind of a jackass. I beat you fair and square, goddammit. Stay the hell away from my kind. Oh, you bastard. <laughs> you can't do this to me. I Sick. beat you. I beat a bit you. of a snake. My name's Clyde Blackburn. I'm a pilot and a gambler. Shitty one. <laughs> Fucking shitty. Shitty gambler. You bastard. If you asked me to name my biggest fault, I'd have to tell you. I'm just not a very honest person. Too shit. Fair enough. Friends and happily, let's do this. Welcome aboard. I'm Wilson, by the way. You must be George Rackham. Sure, I'm Rackham. I'm your guy. Let's get this kite up in the air. You're George Rackham, son of the 4th Earl of Windsor. That's right. Hip, hip, go, me. <laughs> the Bristol was everything it was advertised to be. A pure joy to fly. Oh, look at that. It was a crisp, sunny day. Everything would have been perfect had I only been alone. Beautiful one. Uh, graphics. Oh, yeah. Hey back there! It's a great day for a picnic, don't you think? Right, you see that plane up ahead? You need to catch up with it! Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah! So listen, I know this little French place, maybe you pick up a couple of girls. What are you talking about? Girls! This is a test flight! You need to follow the route that plane is setting for you! Okay, you're the boss, apparently. You push forward in front and find out what it's capable of. Well, I need to catch up with this guy, and, uh... What are you doing? Now let's get a feel for the young. Stay close on his tail. Fuck, he just... ...juked me. He just flipped, you bastard. Where the hell is he? Oh, I can't shoot. Come here, you bastard. This isn't too much play for you, is it? Get Shut up! Closer. 
driving well, man. Chill. Getting used to this. Get closer. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on, accelerate. Get to him. Hey, Fuck. pay attention. All right, keep this distance. Bastard, stop. On, I don't know what he's doing. He's reckless flying. He's a king. Let's see how she handles in a gunfight. Guns are unsafe, just in case you get some fancy what ideas. What the fuck, my day? How sweet. Pursued ally. I'm still pursuing him. Oh, you son of a bitch.
Why the bastard? Base. You okay? Yeah. Okay. Oh. Let's get the 
Pitches back to base immediately. All right. That's how we accidentally discovered where Germans were keeping their munitions for half the Western Front. And Wilson's pictures would help HQ launch a major assault. There was just one problem. I'm not sure about this. Oh, come on. We did a great thing. We'll get medals for this. We weren't even supposed to be there. When the commander sees these pictures, he won't care. We did a great thing. We can do it again. I'll make you a deal. If we pile up on this, then you need to promise me that you'll get me back in one piece. Sure thing. Promise. I need your word. Okay, I promise. Stay here, and don't cause any trouble. You know, I did like the guy, but he was kind of naive. Sir, you might want to take a look at these. Saints alive, your man must be one, one hell of a pilot. Fuck yeah. Before we knew it, we were back in the air. Our mission? to clear the way for the bombers so they could blow that fortress all to hell. First, we'd have to down the barrage blimps. Oh, shit. imagine being a lookout on a blimp. Bad luck, Fritz. <laughs> Next, we'd have to deal with their anti-aircraft trucks. The assault was already in full swing when we got there. Fuck. We'd have to deal with all those defenses, then escort our bombers to their target when they arrived. <laughs> Tall order. But victory here could change the course of the whole damn war, they said. Let's do this. Wilson was less than thrilled. Now we're actually doing this, it feels really dangerous. Trust me. And bump yourself in, maybe. Oh, shitty titties. Wait for our bombers. Easy enough. Watch my back. We need to deal with those blimps. All right, then. Fucking blimps, shitty little blimps, fuck you. Ooh, baby. Taking out blimps, this, this is the objective, baby. See you back. Oh! Son of a bitch. Shoot those trucks! What? 
Let's see. Imagine we weave. There we go, right. Next episode and we'll see what happens.